What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of My Ultimate Team. This is episode number 28 and we start today's episode off by applying some contracts uh, to the players in our new Barclays Premier League side looking quite good in the moment. And we also gave a chemistry style of Deadeye to Coutinho or Oscar, one of the two. Um, I just realised I had two of them in my club. I must have got them when I did a pack opening. And um, yeah, there they were. <laughs> I was like, well, I might as well use them then. Uh, so I gave Deadeye to uh, Coutinho, I think it was. And I've got Backbone. I really need to look up what the chemistry styles actually do. I think Backbone is a defensive type of style, so I guess we'll uh, apply that to one of our defenders. But um, anyway, we start today's episode off coming up against this 4 one 2, -one -two uh, full Spanish side plus uh, an Italian striker up top here uh, with a bronze left back at left mid. But um, anyways, this will be Monday morning for you guys. Uh, if you would like an episode of Career Mode today, then uh, get this video to, let's go with 500 likes. Uh, if you can get 500 likes on this video, and that's quite a lot to ask for, but if you can get 500 likes on this video, I will upload some Career Mode for you later on this evening. So 500 likes and an episode of Career Mode will be up later on this evening around 6pm UK time. But uh, anyway, the first game, as you just saw, the side I was coming up against here uh, in this online single match was really frustrating because the guy was actually quite a decent player. Didn't have the best of sides, but it was quite a decent player. But it did take until the 82nd minute, right on the uh, as the clock stopped there, for Eunice Kabul to get his head to the corner and put the ball into the back of the net. So a good header by Kabul. The goalkeeper kind of got caught in no man's land. We were 1-0 up here. And in the 90th minute, the guy had a great chance to hit back here. Ruben Castro, how about this for a half volley? What a superb save, uh, however, by Begovic. He deserved to get an equaliser for that fantastic effort. But uh, it did finish 1-0. It was a really tight game. Um, you know, the online single matches, the unpredictability of it is that one game you can come against a really, really poor player with a really bad side, but the next game you can come against one of the best sides you'll ever see with a great player. This time, it was a, a, a side that wasn't that strong, but it was a really good player. I think a draw would have been fair in that result. I kind of felt sorry for the guy because he did have a nice play style as well. He wasn't always just trying to lump the ball up the pitch with chip through balls, you know, he was trying to play it around really nicely and uh, I felt sorry for the guy, I think he deserved a, a draw in that game, but uh, we did get the win and uh, that's that's very good for me, but uh, we then changed the squad, uh, we went back to our Brazilian slash skill side here, and um, coming up in the next game as well, trying to get another win under our belt here, but obviously my Brazilian side isn't that strong, and uh, came against this really, really decent side, quite a, quite a good mix here, Bundesliga, uh, I think there was some La Liga and... Um, Serie A's players in there, but some decent players nonetheless from a few leagues. And uh, the first chance the game came to him. Look at this from Rogerio Cini, man. I mean, seriously, my goalkeepers are never that great, but Cini made a triple save there. Absolutely fantastic by my goalkeeper. Still 0 0. And in the 49th minute, another good chance here. Bender comes through. And again, Cini makes a great save. Tips it onto the post, and it's still 0 0. Because Cini's not even that good of a goalkeeper, really, when you look at his card. Other than his kicking, he's quite poor. But in the 59th minute, another great chance. Mario Gomez comes through 1 uh, 1 1 for him. And again, Cini makes the save. The guy was on fire, he was making so many saves and in the 83rd minute, it's a 3 on 2, what a chance and again, the shot by Gomez is well saved by Cini, he was stopping everything, still 0-0 and in the 86th minute, Dante gives it to Jadson Jadson sees the run of Rickard Leeson down the left-hand side here, chips it over the top to Bernard, Bernard, uh, Bernard sorry, with a great chest, goes through 1-1, one -one. brilliant uh, stop by the goalkeeper sadly and it's still 0-0, but uh, that was a great chance to have a snatch and grab there, but from the corner, Ronaldinho crosses the wall in, it's headed up in the air it's cleared away, only as far as Jadson, it comes to Dante who strikes it into the top corner on the half volley fantastic strike by Dante beats the goalkeeper here and uh, we go 1-0 up with 3 minutes to go and I've got to be honest that was the most undeserved victory you'll ever see because we did manage to hang on and get the win, it was an online single match but um, it was it was just the most undeserved victory you'll ever see, Ruggiero Cini played out of his skin, he's such an inconsistent goalkeeper, like some games he's really really good, some games he couldn't save a word document, he's just so inconsistent but we got the win and as you'll see by the stats here you know the guy dominated me I only had two shots on target and uh, one of those was the goal by Dante and as you can see he had 11 shots six on target 54% of possession to my 46 and um, yeah Ruggiero Cini was just on fire and the guy sent me a message after this as well saying didn't know Cini was Neuer <laughs> I didn't know that either it was uh, a good message but uh, yeah it was an amazing performance by Cini and uh, definitely worthy of the greatest goalkeeper all time on that performance but um, anyway yeah yeah, we did get the win, so two wins out of two, I was very happy with that, both in the online single matches, sadly, because uh, you don't really get any rewards for it, you get a few coins, but you don't get any coin bonuses after a few games, like you do in the seasons, um, so we came into a season match here, I saw the message that said that your progress gets deleted if you transfer from PS3 to PS4, which is okay, because I don't think I actually played any games in this division, I think we got relegated and then sort of left
left it. But uh, yeah, we're into Division 4. Uh, we did get relegated from Division uh, 3 a few episodes ago now. And we started off against this 4-4-2 Serie A side. Some awesome players. Marchetti, Constant Kakeres, Chiellini, Abate, El Shirawi, uh, Balotelli and Tevez with a strike partnership and a load of other players. But uh, first chance of the game came to him. A lovely back heel by my defender Koscielny to El Shirawi. And he found Tevez in the area, I think it was, who headed past uh, my goalkeeper. And that was a very, very disappointing goal to concede because Shelny with a second assist there. Um, that was really frustrating. I don't know what I was trying to do. And the guy took a 1-0 lead just nine minutes in. So that was that was my fault. Some poor defending and it was 1-0 up here. And in the 25th minute here, Monreal's on the ball down the left-hand side. Gives it to Asaidi. Plays it through to uh, Oscar down the left-hand side. Real good chance for Oscar as he takes on Abate. Berber's been a reverse step over. Turns himself around. Ronaldo chops to get inside. Heel to heel flick. Lovely skill moves. Takes aim. But Marchetti makes a really good save. And it's cleared away by my opponent. So still 1-0. But on the stroke of half-time, a good chance for us here. It's uh, Loic Remy on the ball. Nice little step over. Gets himself through. Shoots. Good save by Marchetti and Oscar. Oh, my goodness. Seriously. How on earth did he put the ball over there? It's a free volley. We're about 10 yards out. Open goal. And he blazes the ball into the stand. So, 1-0 here. And uh, he see Begovic make a superb save in the 56th minute to deny Balotelli. I think it was still 1-0. But uh, from the corner, it's towards Kakeres. It's headed off the bar. We don't really get the ball away very well as Asaidi gives it straight to Carlos Tevez. Uh, eventually, the ball comes to El Shirawi back to Tevez. Tevez on the ball, shoots, and it's a wonderful goal by my opponent. Really, really good strike. No chance for Begovic there. And uh, Sally goes 2 0 up. So um, this is just really frustrating, really, because this is me all over. You know, online single matches with nothing at stake. Fine, I'll get a win with no problem. But uh, coming into a season's game with uh, relegation and promotion at stake, it's it's always too fearful for me, and I always seem to crumble under pressure. But uh, yeah, Tevez gets the goal. It's a really good strike, and uh, he watches the replays twice, and uh, he deserved to because it was a really nice goal by Tevez so yeah my opponent goes 2-0 up he was playing really well but uh, straight from kickoff Oscar's on the ball he gives the ball away though it comes to Sanjo he finds Loic Remy back to Oscar Oscar finds Ben Arthur Ben Arthur with a scoop turn first time then the Berber spin to get around his man plays it out wide to Coutinho nice couple of skills there Coutinho with a first time cross Loic Remy gets the header and makes it 2-1 so straight from kickoff we're back in the game here 2-1 good chance for us to come back and in the 75th minute Balotelli's on the ball but he gives it away comes to Loic Remy great chip ball over the top to Oscar a wonderful first touch and he makes up for his mistake in the first half where he missed an open goal with a very good finish past Marchetti there and it makes it 2-2 so we're back on double terms the uh, comeback from 2-0 down was complete but with five minutes to go, uh, Eunice Kabul gets out muscled by Balotelli. Balotelli runs through, and it's a really awesome finish by the Milan striker. So that was a, a lovely finish by Balotelli, and uh, it was a, a good strike and a good finish by the guy. It was 3-2. He, he put himself back in front again, and uh, a really good strike by Balotelli after a nice free ball. And sadly, uh, in the 90th minute here, we have a great chance to come back and get ourselves the equalising goal. Uh, Remy comes through here, but his header is well saved by Marchetti as it brings him out. I, I probably should have took a touch there and tried to round him. I've right or to the left but instead I thought I'd go with a direct approach try and uh, nod the ball over the oncoming keeper but sadly it uh, went straight into him and uh, Marchetti made the save and it finished 3-2 so 3-2 uh, it's the first loss of the episode and it is of course in the seasons which is no real surprise and it was a pretty balanced game I think he deserved a win really but uh, a draw would have been fair as well so either a draw or his win would have been fair he got the win so you have to say well done to the guy so 3-2 to him and uh, straight after the game we brought ourselves a cliche uh, a Gail cliche for 5,000 coins here he's got the backbone chemistry style, uh, which I think is the one we've already got in our club, um, and he'll replace Monreal, and the reason being is because Monreal, like, he's just, he's the weak link of the team, and, like, I know what people are going to say, oh, you pace whore, you're only using Clichy for pace, you don't like Monreal because he's slow and so on, but i got to be honest, he's really, really poor, like, all the wingers in FIFA, you know, online are fast, you know, whenever you come against an ultimate team team, an ultimate team team, uh, an online ultimate team, they're always fast wingers, and he just can't keep up with them, you know, and he's just so poor, and uh, that's why I replaced him with Clichy, who's a lot faster, of course, and uh, hopefully he'll do the job, but the final game was against this 4-3-3, Barclays Premier League side and how about this man it turns out I replaced the wrong man because uh, well it wasn't uh, Monreal that got caught out it was Begovic that was so annoying Baines launches a ball forward and Begovic I didn't hold triangle I didn't call him to come out but instead he has a Joe Hart moment goes flying out of his goal misses with the header and Etu volleys it into the open goal so it's 1-0 to my opponent here in 48, uh, 49th minute sorry we did manage to come back uh, a really good strike by Coutinho past the goalkeeper to make it 1-1 here so back on the terms and in the 57th minute Koscielny finds Loic Remy 
Remy's onto the ball. Nice turn to get past Fellaini. Plays a wonderful free ball to Ben Arthur. Lovely vision there. Ben Arthur with the fake shot. Gets past Leighton Baines and finesses it into the corner. So 2-1 to us. And that is also how the game finished as well. So we did collect the three points. And I was very, very pleased to get the win in this game. Because uh, we, we disappointingly lost the last game when it was very tight. But I was very pleased to get back to winning ways and get the three points. And uh, as always, guys, big thank you for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, 500 likes. And I'll upload an episode of Career Mode for you later on this evening. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow. But uh, 500 likes for an episode of Career Mode later on this evening.